Hi, and welcome to our Pilates Basics. We're going to learn pelvic curls now. So come onto the ground, lying on your back, soles of the feet down, hip width distance apart. Okay, so basically what we're doing here is articulating the spine and working our abdomen and our glutes. It's going to target the glutes quite a lot. So before we start, we're actually gonna do a little activation of the glutes. So take your legs and relax them down. And take your hands to either side of your buttocks or even sit on them if you want. And then trying to keep your thighs completely, completely relaxed. So maybe just flip the feet in and out a little bit. We're going to just basically try and squeeze on the glutes. See if you can keep this relaxed and let it go. And then squeeze on the glutes. You probably feel your hips lift up a little bit and let go. If you feel that you're, as you're trying this and just keep trying it a few times, if you feel like your thighs are really activating, rotate the feet out so the toes just flop out to the side. It's gonna help you stop activating in the thighs. So we wanna just try and isolate the glutes from the thighs because this is gonna be targeting the glutes and the abdomen versus the thighs. We're actually gonna be working the hamstrings if anything. So come and place the feet down, hip width distance apart. And I like to put them, my feet so that just the middle finger of my hand can touch the back of the heel. But sometimes you might just need to walk that a bit further away, a bit further in, depending on you. And then from here, let's adopt a neutral pelvic alignment. So hip bones, pubic bone in the line. And then let's put on our T-zone. So we're thinking of drawing that pubic bone up towards the stomach, the two hip bones coming in towards each other and keeping that on for the entire exercise. Okay, hands are down by the side. We're gonna use an inhale T-zone. Exhale, we're going to peel every part of the vertebrae all the way up until we are literally like a plank up in the air. I'm squeezing on my glutes. My ribs are drawing towards my hips so I don't flare. So it's less like a sort of yoga bridge pose. This is more like an inverted plank. Now we're going to inhale, stay here, squeeze that T-zone on, and then reverse, trying to connect each and every part of the spine back and down with the mat, returning back to your neutral position. So let's do this again. Inhale, T-zone. Exhale, rolling vertebra by vertebra all the way up. So you're just on top of the shoulder blades. Inhale to squeeze and stay exhale reversing so i'm thinking ribs drawing to my hips so i can feel each and every part of my spine come down onto the mat back to neutral inhale hold exhale to lift up so we'll continue with this pattern you can move in your own breath pattern inhale to pause at the top exhale drawing the ribs down towards the pelvis okay so hopefully by now you'll already be feeling the glutes working. So we wanna feel the glutes and the undersides of the legs really firing. And also the core here, as you draw the belly in towards the spine, as you roll each vertebrae back down. So let's go for two more like this. Really trying to keep it even, make sure you're not flopping over to one side. Good. So you might even wanna place your hands on the hips to really monitor that. Let's go for one more. So you inhale at the bottom. And then you lift up, keep pressing the feet down into the mat, draw the ribs back, 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 back down, and then just rest in your neutral position. Great. Coming up to here. Thanks so much. That's our curls. Go and have a little explore with that. Ciao.